Hi, I'm attorney Rick Lundeen with the Auto Accident and Personal Injury Law Firm Nichols, Born & Lundeen in Silver Spring, Maryland. In this video, I want to answer the question, what is PIP and how do you get it? If you've been injured in an auto accident in Maryland, you may have heard people talking about PIP or PIP. PIP is the acronym that stands for Personal Injury Protection. PIP benefits are a first party coverage, meaning you get them from the insurance company for the car you were in at the time of the accident or from your own policy that you maintain. Or if you're a pedestrian or on a bicycle, you would get them from the car that struck you. PIP benefits pay your medical bills, lost wages, and certain other expenses up to the amount of the coverage. PIP benefits are in addition to your claim against the at-fault driver for his or her negligence. PIP benefits are required on all insurance policies issued in the state of Maryland except for taxis, buses, state-owned vehicles, and motorcycles. What does PIP pay for? PIP pays for reasonable and necessary medical, ambulance, and dental bills. These must be incurred within three years of the accident. PIP also pays for 85% of lost wages, funeral expenses, and household services that you're unable to perform, such as housekeeping and lawn service. You're paid PIP whether or not the accident was your fault. How much PIP does the insurance company pay you? It depends on the amount that was purchased. The statutory minimum in Maryland is $2,500, but higher amounts are available, and sometimes people purchase $5,000, $7,500, or even $10,000. So look at the policy carefully to see how much PIP you might be entitled to. You should buy as much PIP as you can, and you should look at your policy right now and call your agent and increase your PIP to the maximum amount that you can afford. It doesn't cost that much. You should try for $10,000. So how do you get PIP? You do not receive PIP automatically. You have to apply for it and prove that you've incurred certain types of losses as a result of an auto accident. You should request your PIP benefits or file your application in writing. I recommend by fax so you have a record of the date and time that you sent it. The application for PIP benefits must be made within one year of the accident. This is important. You must file for PIP within one year of the accident, and you must receive the medical care that you are seeking to have paid by PIP within three years. Will your rates go up if you file a PIP claim? We get this question all the time. The answer is clearly, by law, no. In fact, the statute specifically provides that the insurance company cannot raise your rates because you file a PIP claim. Section 19507C of the Maryland Insurance Article expressly prohibits the insurance company from surcharging, that is raising, your rates because you filed a PIP claim. Now, can you be excluded from PIP? Unfortunately, yes. If you signed a waiver of PIP at the time you purchased your insurance, you will not get PIP and neither will any family members living with you who are over the age of 16. However, other people, like a neighbor, who's in your car at the time of the accident, would not be excluded and would get PIP. And any children in your home under 16 would get PIP even if you sign the waiver. In addition, there's no PIP coverage if the injury was intentional, the person claiming PIP was in a stolen vehicle, or committing a felony, or fleeing and eluding the police at the time of the accident, or if the person seeking PIP was a pedestrian and a non-resident of Maryland. Also excluded are excluded drivers on the policy. These are people specifically listed on your policy as being excluded from coverage if they're driving your car. If you have any questions about a PIP claim, I encourage you to contact us for a free, no obligation consultation. We'll listen to you and give you specific advice about your case, your rights, and the steps you should be taking right now, both in your PIP claim and in any other claims against the at-fault driver, to build a strong case for maximum compensation and to get the medical care you need to make the best recovery possible from your accident injuries. There's no obligation.